Bonjour, year four. Our topic for today's lesson is Ouvre, dis-moi, which means brown bear, tell me. Use your headphones for best experience. Our objective for today's lesson is Can I retell brown bear story in French? Success criteria. Grow. I can recognize and memorize the French vocabulary. Flourish. I can illustrate the story. Succeed. I can adapt the story and compose a paragraph using all the words learned today. Pour commencer. Let's start with French phonics. Our. O is the pronunciation for these vowels. And if you listen carefully, there is a silent letter in this word. Can you guess what it is? Ur. Yes, you're right. The silent letter is S. Let me read one more for you. D. D. Which is a silent letter here? Yes, you're right. The letter S is silent. Let's see the next word. R. R. U N is pronounced as A. R. A. R. Moi. Moi. OI is pronounced as wa wa along with m it is moi moi répétez après moi ur di brun moi we are done with the french phonics right now let's move on to the story ur brun ur brun Dis-moi ce que tu vois. Je vois un oiseau rouge qui regarde par ici. Oiseau rouge, oiseau rouge, dis-moi ce que tu vois. Je vois un canard jaune qui regarde par ici. Canard jaune, canard jaune, dis-moi ce que tu vois. Je vois un cheval bleu qui regarde par ici. Cheval bleu, cheval bleu, dis-moi ce que tu vois. Je vois une grenouille verte qui regarde par ici. Grenouille verte, grenouille verte, dis-moi ce que tu vois. Je vois un chat violet qui regarde par ici. Chat violet, chat violet, dis-moi ce que tu vois. Je vois un chien blanc. Qui regarde par ici. Chien blanc, chien blanc, dis-moi ce que tu vois. Je vois un mouton noir qui regarde par ici. Mouton noir, mouton noir, dis-moi ce que tu vois. Je vois un poisson orange qui regarde par ici. Poisson orange, poisson orange, dis-moi ce que tu vois. Je vois une institutrice qui regarde par ici. Madame Jenny, Madame Jenny, dis-moi ce que tu vois. Je vois des élèves qui regardent par ici. Enfant, enfant, dis-moi ce que vous voyez. Nous voyons un ours brun, un oiseau rouge, un canard jaune, un cheval bleu, une grenouille verte, un chat violet, un chien blanc, un mouton noir, un poisson orange et Madame Jenny qui regarde par ici. Ça fait beaucoup de monde. And here we have come to the end of the story.
I hope you enjoyed the story. Let's move on to the activity now. Our first activity is that read the words below the picture and color them correctly. Also, practice spelling by read cover write method, which we did last week and week before. This activity will take at least 10 minutes for you to complete. While you're doing this activity, pause the video right now. Let's self assess. Here are the answers for you. The colors are already given here. You just have to check and mark yourself out of nine. Let's move on to our last task. Our today's task is Invente deux phrases sur le modèle. Invente deux phrases sur le modèle, which means invent two sentences on the model. You will be creating two sentences on the model given over here. Let's read this. Urbra, urbra. Dis-moi ce que tu vois. Je vois un oiseau jaune qui regarde par ici. Can you guess what this means? Yes, you're right. It means brown bear, brown bear. Tell me what you see. I see a yellow bird which looks at me. Do you remember from where these sentences are? Yes, you've guessed it right. It is from the story that we just read. Now what you will do is, you will be creating sentences just like this, except the animal name, the color, you would change. So for example, Instead of Urpre, you would write a different animal's name and a different color. And over here you have an oiseau jaune. Instead of an oiseau jaune, you will write a different animal's name and a color. All right. It could be either an animal name or it could be any other thing. All right. So that's your choice. You can choose. You could either write animal names or you could write any other word that you've come across in your French lesson. All right. I hope you understood how you would be doing it. And also remember to keep these underlined lines as it is. Dis-moi ce que tu vois. Je vois qui regarde par ici. Keep the lines as it is. Do not change them. You will just change the animal name and the color. It could be any other animal name or a bird's name or it could be any other word that you have learned. But remember, it should be only a noun. The expectation criteria is given over here. It says two animals and its color. One animal over here and another over here. But I also told you it could be either an animal or any other word that you know in French. All right, but your sentence should make sense with the noun that you're writing over here. And the underlined words should be written as it is. You will not change the underlined words. After completing your work, you could either take a printout of the sheet and complete your work or on a plain A4 paper, you could still complete or if you have a whiteboard at home, you could still use the whiteboard to complete your work. After completing your work, that is your written work, next is illustre ton text, which means you're going to illustrate your text. What does that mean? Yes, you're right. You are going to do a bit of drawing. The words that you've written here, the sentences that you have made, you're going to draw 
a picture related to the lines that you've written here. All right. You may even color your picture, make it creative. It's your choice. It's up to you. All right. Hope you understood what you will be doing for today's task. And this task will definitely take at least 20 minutes for you to complete. Upload your creative paragraph on Seesaw. Don't forget. And remember to follow our YouTube channel, Easy French at GFS. Au revoir.